status post rk a post ray sub capsule of cataract extensively worked up before the surgery with pentacam with opd3 scan and calculated the power of the i will based upon various factors translimbal corneal 2.8 mm keratometry visco in the entry chamber tunnel floor entry technique of performing continuous capsule door access note that the chamber is steady it's not shallowing by leaking of viscoelastic so control on the rexis progression is very good it's a high myopic eye the translimbal entry to the eye was enlarged with the blunt keratome one person lignocaine in the on the surface of iris and in the anterior chamber nucleus is prolapsed after doing a capsular separating hydrodissection supported by the mini vectus the soft cataract was guided out of the eye with visco in continuous injection 25 gauge candle is used which injects or infuses visco visco hpmc into the anterior chamber the tunnel is kept open and with the pressure of injection of viscoelastic the the uh, nucleus and epinucleus material comes out a simco is used to completely remove the entire cortex the entire surgery is being done under low pressure pressure has not been at no point of time even during the rexis pressure is not more than the normal pressures note that the zonules are not stretched or pushed or pulled in any directions throughout the surgery it's most friendly to the endothelium as well as to the zonules the tunnel that we have made produces about half adapter or even 0.75 adapters of astigmatism depending upon where i have entered here i have entered beyond little beyond the limbus and there is a very tiny congenital flap there i will is injected into the eye and position horizontally so that the haptic optic junctions lie at 9 o'clock and 3 o'clock positions the entire cortex is aspirated and the surgery is completed thank you